take the cover off the charger. I think I'll go ahead and take these knockouts. Input PV, output to the battery. So I got this tacked up here. I'm not going to put it all the way up until later because this has to come apart again. The panel's mounted, got my cable trays. This is all temporarily mounted so that I can mark all the knockouts. Once I get everything up here, then I'm going to take it all down and use my that hole punch knockout kit to uh, get all this stuff taken care of. It's coming together. So now I've got my transfer panel and my secondary output panel temporarily mounted and marked off where the knockouts have to go into the cable trays. Okay, so when I watch YouTube, I see a lot of people always expanding their system, and I, I anticipate I'll do that too. So I designed this initially for the 4K. I got one charge controller, but I've installed all these panels and everything so that I can expand it. So the first 4K is costing me about $13,000. That's for all this stuff after rebates. Uh, the next 4K, I'll just add another charger, and the panels and all this stuff is already designed to handle it. So that'll cost $6,000 to add the second 4K, and so on. I can put another 4K for a total of 12K system and drop it right in here. If I do that, I probably will double the battery bank, and I've designed the box to handle uh, double the size. So, uh, we're... It's, the system's initially going to start off at 4K and at $13,000 and can be expandable up to 12K and it would be uh, 19, be about $25,000 for a 12K system.